YouTube, what is up? Welcome back to the channel, guys. Today, we got another South Park episode to check out. But before we go any further, I need you to do me a solid. If you could drop a like and a comment on this video for the algorithm, I would greatly appreciate it. But uh, y'all ready for this one? Let's run it, baby. Let's get it. Let's go. Mitsubaris with a tasty crunch. Get back, Justice Believers, and listen to another edition of America's favorite superhero, Mint Berry Crunch. This dude gives me like Captain Crunch vibes, bro. And not the character itself, but the cereal. You feel me? Joined by the other coon friends, Mint Berry Crunch went to investigate the Gulf Spill crisis. The superheroes came across a cult in existence for years that had been waiting for Cthulhu's arrival. They are the key to stopping Cthulhu from taking over the world. Sometimes when everything seems hopeless, that's when you need to bring it all. That's when you need to bring the crunch. <laughs> Yo, I do got to say, man, I do got to say, I'm really digging these comic book uh, recaps. They did, it, they did that last episode and then they did it on this one as well. I really like that. If they could make an episode that's like comic style the whole way, you know what I'm saying? Like this intro was, bro, that would be epic. I think that would be epic. Dude, I'm sorry, but we still aren't getting it. You're half man and half berry? Right! Wait, what's your superpower, Mysterion? I can't die. Oh, yeah, good one. Mysterion can't die, and Iron Maiden is indestructible. No, Stan, I'm being serious. I really, really can't die. What? Like last night in the alley, the cult leader stabbed me and I bled all over the place. And you screamed, oh my god, and you called him a bastard! When was that? All the time! I die all the time! And you assholes never remember! I think we would remember you dying, dude. Oh, <laughs> That makes a lot of sense, bro. That makes a lot of sense. Well, you don't! I die over and over! Only to wake up in my bed like nothing happened! Dude, you're freaking out Mintberry Crunch. He's peed his pants. No, no. <laughs> Mintberry Crunch doesn't ever pee his pants. I think it'd be pretty cool not to be able to die. Pretty cool? Not pretty cool, Kyle. It fucking hurts. And it won't go away, and nobody will believe me. Remember this time. Try and fucking remember. <laughs> oh, oh, my God. God. Oh, shit, dude. Dude, is he? Oh, Jesus. Hey. <laughs> no. No. Yo, my man's blueberry boy ran away. Bro, could you imagine if him doing it himself didn't work? You know what I'm saying? Like, him doing it himself didn't enable him to come back? Bro, that would be bad. Without warning, the Kuhn friends changed. Their superpowers morphed somehow, turning them into no. super villains. The Kuhn tried to reason with them, tried to bring them back to the side of good. But it was too late. Their black hearts had been tainted by hate and rage. Kuhn was alone, torn by the ultimate dilemma. Hold on. Time out, bro. Cartman is literally... I know you've met people like this before. When they'll tell you... Let's say something happened between them and somebody else, right? They'll tell you their part of the story and what the other person did wrong, but they won't tell you what they themselves did to trigger that behavior in somebody else. Grimy, bro. Dirty. Narcissistic. That's it. That's what it is. You guys have no memory of me shooting myself in the head, do you? What? What well, we need crazy. to do is talk to people in that cult. I want to know where my powers come from. Yeah, cool. Let's talk about where our powers come from. I was bit by a radioactive mosquito. <laughs> I was in a That's not what he means, bro. Y'all got, got imaginary powers. Kenny literally dies and come back. He he's on his he's on his Undertaker ish, bro. He is a dead man walking. Car accident, then put back together with Tupperware parts. T -t 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 Will you guys listen to me? I actually have a power that I actually want to know about. Hey guys. So uh -oh. what's going on? Go away, Cartman. We kicked you out of Coon and Friends. Remember? No, I, I know that's cool. I understand. Even though I started it in the secret bases in my house. Yeah, no, that's totally understandable. <laughs> you just wanted to frame and blackmail people. Then you beat up Clyde and Bradley for no reason. No, you're right. For no reason. Clearly something is wrong with me. But you guys, what should I do? What should I do? You should fuck off. That's what you should do. <laughs> <laughs> A 
My man Kyle. Let's get it, bro. I rock with Kyle. At first, like when I when I first started watching South Park and I was getting to know the characters, I didn't really rock with Kyle like that. But the whole superhero saga and then parts of season 20, I started to rock with homie. You know what I mean? Oh, crap. I forgot about the Dark Lord, bro. This is a setup. He got merch on. <laughs> Yo, how long did it take to get to get him to put the shirt on? How long did it take to make the shirt? You know what I'm saying? That's crazy. What are you doing with that thing? Yo, he's he's going to help me get rid of you guys. So together we can make the world a better place. Cartman, if you team up with the most evil thing in the universe, then clearly you are the bad guy. Facts. No, because it's for the greater good, like when Superman teamed up with Lex Luthor. Superman never teamed up with Lex Luthor. <laughs> well, that's why Superman isn't around anymore, isn't it? It might you be. Know, it might banish be. Banish them to a dark oblivion, please. Ah! Oh. Oh, dude, that was awesome. He really you're took like, them. Nah, and they're all like, nah. Yo, where? Wh where did they go? All right, now, we've taken out most of the synagogues, destroyed San Francisco, sent my friends into a dark... The synagogue? Yo, <laughs> he got rid of the Jews? Dark Oblivion, and so our next order of business will be Burning Man. What's that? Burning Man is the biggest hippie festival in the world, and tomorrow, <laughs> we're going to wipe them all out. Pretty soon, the whole world will be transformed thanks to the king. Yo, I hate this kid so much, man, but I love him at the same time, bro. He's so petty, bro. He's literally getting rid of everything and everyone that he dislikes. The only only thing I didn't hear him mention was uh uh the gingers, but I don't know, maybe later on, you feel me? Dude, where the fuck are we? Oh, they're in the upside down. I don't know, but I feel like I've been here before. Oh damn. Hold on. If anybody if anybody has a chance out of everybody there, it's Kenny. All he got to do is, is is find a way to get one of those things to delete him or him delete himself. You know what I'm saying? And he'll end up back in his bed. Hopefully, it's like through the dimensions. Like, he's still able to use his powers. If not, then, damn, he's screwed. Well, maybe we should just find a place to hide and wait for help. What help, dude? Nobody in the real world even knows we're here. All right, you guys hide as long as you can. I'll try and find help. How, dude? Kenny, where the hell are you going? I'm going to try to get you all out of here. If this works. Or I could be wrong. Kenny! Hey, oh, he did it, bro. He did hurts. it. Is it not going to work? Oh, my God. Kenny, you... You crazy bastard! <laughs> Oh, it did work. Oh, my God. Bro, I was about to say, Loki, Loki, he kind of scared me there, bro. I thought I thought he was done. I thought he was done for the episode. Damn. Fucking hippies. Fuck all you. <laughs> Yo, I've never seen a kid have so much Dark hatred in his heart. Who is bringing his angry wrath down upon the Burning Man Festival, Tom. Cthulhu isn't behaving as most scientists had speculated, Tom, but the Dark Lord is wreaking havoc everywhere and- No, 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 excuse me. It is not Cthulhu, it is Kuhn and Fran. I'm a little sick of everyone giving him all the credit when I'm the one really making the world a better place. Tom, it appears that Bruce Valanche has arrived on the scene wearing a rat costume. Oh, you <laughs> motherfucker. Cthulhu, this guy too. Thank you. Oh, get that fire twirling Damn. Oh, joy. It's underwear boy again. <laughs> that god Yo, you he means business, bro. All my friends. Not our god. He promised everything would change if we worshipped him, but we're still sitting here smoking cigarettes like before. It's like Obama all over again. <laughs> How do I fight him? Tulu isn't alive or dead, right? Tell me what that means. Henrietta, your little brother wants to play with you. Go away, Mom. I hate you. Oh, Just my God. Just let your brother play with your friends, sweetie. He's lonely. Go on in, Bradley. 
Will you guys pay Yo! me? Yo! I don't want you here. Please, can I get... Oh, That's Blueberry I'm Boy. Uh, that's okay, sis. I'll play with you another time. Mysterio. Yo, he's such a punk, bro. He runs away every single time. Yo, I had no idea they were related. That right there is a plot twist. That's a crazy plot twist. The Necronomicon is an account of the Old Ones, their history, and the means for summoning them. Old Ones? Dark deities that existed before man. It was written by a mad prince who knew of the nightmare city of Ralia, which fell from the stars and That's where they are. The sea and in another dimension. That's it. That's the place I just was. You've been to the nightmare city of Ralia? Lucky. Cthulhu and other <laughs> beings are from this city, but for years cultists have tried to our world. And what about Cthulhu's power? Why can't old ones die? The only thing that can destroy an immortal is another immortal. Mmm, let's go. Ha ha! Don't worry. Yo, Kenny, Kenny is, Kenny is the key. Kenny is the only one that can defeat homie. Us coon friends need to stick together, remember? Well, where are you going? Wherever Cthulhu is. What? But he'll kill you. Maybe, but with any luck, I might find the reason for my powers. Oh, right. So Maybe now the, now, the reason for my powers. now it's not just saving them, bro. Now it's looking for answers. So now it's bigger. Now it's bigger than him. Now it's now it has more meaning and more purpose. You know what I mean? This kid right here, though, man, Blueberry Boy, I forgot his name. He's a liability. He should go hang out with your gothic sister, bro. Like, I can't even trust you right now. You know what I mean? Because because you're a blood relative to one of them, dog. <laughs> one of the ops. I can't I can't rock with you. Kenny, what the hell I sent you to, to the sunken city of Ryla falling from the stars? You little fucking prick. Beat his ass, Kenny. What kind of sick fuck does that to his friends? Right. It's not my fault you guys turned evil, Kenny. You are the bad guy, fat boy. You. I'm going around making the world a better place for you. You're making it a better place for you. Right. Right? That's what superheroes do. No, <laughs> this is what superheroes do. <laughs> you banished me, but I'm back. What does that make me? A mortal. Bring back my friends. Take me. Mysteria, no. What are you doing? Oh my God. Only an immortal Go home, can kill kid. another immortal. Here's your prize. Take this curse away from me, you big pussy. Don't listen to him, Cthulhu. We have more important stuff to do. Yo, he's talking big to, to homie. Shout out to Kenny, bro. He's brave. Fuck you, Kenny. <laughs> Come back, you fat piece of shit. What is that? Hello, my son. If That's you are his dad? If this message, then it must be dark times, and you must have many questions. Your true oh, name crap. is Gok Zara. The power given to you comes from a planet far away. You are from that planet, Gok Zara. It is for that reason you have a power that normal humans do not have. I know you must sometimes see this power as a curse, but you were sent here to stop evil from taking over the Earth, and now that time has apparently come. You must now harness and focus your power, Gok Zara. The power of mint and berries, yet with a tasty, satisfying crunch. Oh, crap. Yes, yes, please go on. It's for Your him. Kokujon is known throughout the universe for its berry mines. Berries that have the power to fuel nearly anything. Needless to say, when the mint hunters of Kogan Ra got word of them, our fate was already sealed, Kok Zara. But our two worlds... Coke Zara? Is his name Coke Zero? Is that what he's saying? It's collided, and soon Mint and Barry were one. Wow! Your mother and I sent you as far away as we could. Use your power, son. Save Earth. Shablagu. What's his power, though? No more running away for Mint Barry Crunch! Yo, he had powers this whole time? Yo, it looked like he was throwing Captain Crunch at him at first. I reached the Gulf of Mexico with no time. And with all my strength, I dragged Cthulhu back to the depths from whence he came. Get the hell out of here. Companions are there, still alive. I returned them to their world, encased in a protective berry 
free bubble. Then it's back down to seal up the hole created by the BP oil company. Returning home only momentarily to flip off my fat sister. <laughs> Yo, hold on, hold on, hold on. I kind of feel robbed, bro. I'm not going to lie. I kind of feel robbed. Let me tell you why. I thought this whole time it was Mysterion that had the powers. I thought it was Kenny. And I was looking forward to Kenny putting uh, the Dark Lord away, bro. But it didn't happen. It didn't happen. It ended up being Blueberry Boy. Dude, thanks for getting us out of that dark oblivion, Midberry Crunch. No, no. We worked as a team. All the Coon and friends stopped the BP drilling spill crisis. And finally, the evil Coon is right where he belongs. <laughs> Come on, you guys, this is fucking bullcrap. Let me out. You're not going anywhere for a long time. Yes. This is name. There's a big bucket with butter's poop in here, and there's nothing to eat. You got poop, don't you? You got to do what you got to do. There are still many more questions left unanswered. I need to know what happened to my parents. Well, come back and visit anytime, dude. I will. Shabla-goo. That's crazy. Fucking mint berry fucking crunch. Wow, can you believe it, Kenny? Bradley actually had superpowers. Isn't that cool? Yeah. I'm tired, guys. Think I'm going to go to bed. <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> Holy shit, dude! Kenny! No! No! That's like him doing that is like the men in black, um, you know, the, the junk that Will Smith uses and, and wipes your memory. What? What? what the hell? It's happening again! Hey, yo, hold on. To that stupid cult meeting. We got to we got to we we got to talk about that. We got to talk about that. Hold on. So whole time this this is this is my takeaway. This is what I got from that. This whole time he doesn't die and end up in his bed. He dies and he's born again. And then I guess he grows overnight. I don't know. I, I don't know the I don't know how that part of it works out. But, bro, that is trippy. Yo, if, if y'all know something, I don't know. Sound off in the comments below, bro, because I got to I got to figure this out. I'm legitimately like mind blown right now. You know what I'm saying? But anyways, this was a dope episode. This whole superhero saga was was fire, bro. Um, somebody told me in the comments that there's another one. I don't know, though. I don't know. Somebody told me there's another episode that I got to watch that has to do or is connected, one or the other, um, with the superhero saga. I don't know which one it is, though, so I'm going to need y'all to tell me in the comments below. Listen, I appreciate y'all pulling up and watching this video with me. If you enjoyed this reaction, go ahead and smash that like button. Smash that subscribe button if you haven't yet enjoyed the family. Till next time, I'm out. Peace.